Hello, Leander ISD, and welcome to the Mental Health Minute. Today, we're going to talk about our circle of control. There are lots of things in our everyday lives that are in our control and others that are outside of our control. For example, the fact that there may be a test in science tomorrow is not in your control, but how prepared you feel for the test is in your control. It is important to put your time, energy, and emotions towards things you can control and not waste them on things you cannot control. You can spend time and energy worrying about being mad that there is a test at all, or you can spend your time and energy studying and being prepared for the test. Sometimes it's even helpful to draw out a circle on a piece of paper and take a moment to think about what you can control and what is in your circle of control. Things like yourself, your behavior, the words you say, your attitude are all in your circle of control. You can change those things and add to the outside of the circle things that are not in your control. The weather, your friends, family, school rules, and guidelines, those are all things we typically can't change and are out of our circle of control. However, sometimes there are things that may seem outside your control that are worth fighting for change. Next time you're feeling worried or stressed about something, stop to think of it as something you're in your control or not. If it is, what can you do about it? If it is not in your control, what do you need to let go or find a way to make a change? Remember to focus most of your time and energy on the things within your circle of control. Have a great day.